That's it. Tell me why you're so interested in my kid, huh? Why was Stacy willing to raise my child? It's not your child. It's my child. It's my child. What? It's crazy. No, it's not. No, it's not. It's the truth. You aren't having Rex's baby, are you? You got me. It's a bowling ball. I know it's a baby. It's just not Rex's. Of course it's Rex's. Who else's would it be? I am that baby's father. That's why I had to get up this mountain with a snowstorm coming, because I had to tell Jeet. I don't believe it. Think about it. Why would I lie? Addict. Lying is what you do best. I've been clean longer than you've known me. Known you? Other than the fact that you're a junkie, I don't know squat about you. Rex, this has nothing to do with my addiction, okay? I had sex with Stacy and she got pregnant. You, you, you gotta be high. You're, you're hallucinating. Oh, I wish. I wish that I was making this up. Okay. Even if you were sleeping with Stacy at the same time that I did, it doesn't prove anything. We still need a paternity test. You're high. I am not high. And I was not sleeping with Stacy when she slept with you. I had sex with her, yes, once. About a month later. I told you. You're not making any sense, okay? We both know when Stacy got pregnant. You were there at the hospital when she had the test Yeah, done. because back then, Rex, it was your baby she was carrying. But now she's not. She had a miscarriage. She lost her child, Rex, I'm sorry. How should I know who you've had sex with? Isn't that how you made a living? I was a stripper, not a hooker. Whatever. Look, I love Rex. He's the only one who could be the father of my baby. Then why all the lying about the water breaking? Why fake labor when you're not ready to give birth? Why? Ah. Oh. oh my God. Oh. Nice try, but you can only get away with faking labor once. I'm not faking it this time. Oh. Ah, so you admit it, you faked it at the hospital. Please, please. Why were you trying to trick Rex into thinking that you're having the baby now? I am. I'm happy right now. I'm right, aren't I? It's not Rex's baby. Oh, shut up, I'm in pain. Stacey, you are not going to use this baby to get out of telling me the truth. Oh, my back feels like it's on fire. Oh, it hurts so bad right here. Okay, so you write up on real symptoms. Rex, I need you. Okay, what kind of twisted SOB are you telling me that my baby died? I'm sorry, I'm sorry, but it's true. That's why the baby she's carrying isn't full term yet. Well, now I know you're full of it. You saw us at the hospital. She was in labor. Yeah, yeah, the labor stopped, though, didn't it? Yeah, because it was false labor. It's not like she faked it. Okay, her water broke. Rex, your water doesn't break in a false labor. It's just contractions. I was with her when it happened. Were, were you in the room? Were you in the actual room? She faked it, Rex. Now, I, I don't know how, but this is Stacy we're talking about. I wouldn't put anything past her. <sighs> Not this. If, if, if she had lost the baby, she would have told me. <laughs> Why? Getting pregnant with your kid finally got you to pay attention to her. She wasn't going to give that up. She had something that you two would share forever. So she did something desperate. You need to know. You need to know everything. So tell me. OK. OK, as soon as it sunk in that Stacy had lost her baby, she got it in her head that she could get pregnant again. And so I guess because she and I used to have a thing, I was the perfect candidate. So you just, she drugged me. What? Well, she, she knew she couldn't seduce me. I mean, I wasn't into her at all. So she drugged me. Just to get pregnant? Oh, come on. After all this stuff she pulled with Shane's stem cells, you really think she would draw the line of slipping me a Mickey? I was so hazy. I don't even remember having sex with her. But when I found her patting her stomach so that she could look like she was more pregnant than she was, that's when she told me the truth. You know, uh, d d Dr. Baez confirmed the due date. Did the doctor tell you that herself? Rex? I saw the sonogram. The baby's right on schedule. You saw the sonogram that Kim and Stacy showed you. Were you even in the room when they did it? Were you in the room for any of the checkups? I, I found another doctor. It's it's not the one you guys recommended, so I'll let you know about the appointment. You're lucky. You're carrying small. You know what I'm saying is true. <sighs> that one was 30 seconds long. 
Stacy, you better not be faking this. Oh, I couldn't make this up. I can't take it. It must be Rex's baby because you're definitely in labor. Uh, I live with Stacy. She sure as heck has not been patting her stomach for the last month. When did you find out? November. You've known about this for months? Why didn't you say anything? Why'd you let me go on thinking that the baby was mine? Huh? What about Gigi? You knew how upset she was. Oh. Oh, you were her shoulder to cry on. Her white knight. I was the creep who knocked up her sister. You let everyone live this lie so that you could get Gigi. It's dead. The blizzard knocked out the phone line. Wait here and keep trying to get a call out. Wait, where are you going? I'm going to check the roads and see if there's any way we can drive to the hospital. No, you can't go anywhere. What if something happens? Nothing is going to happen to you or your baby, I promise. OK, you're, you're, you're right on schedule. Your body's doing everything it's supposed to. You'll be fine. I'm scared, Gigi. Don't be. Hey, your contractions are about 15 minutes apart now. So? So? This could go on for a really long time. How long? Just save your strength, okay? You'll be in labor for a while. We will get you to a hospital before you're in the final state. <sighs> you let me get attached to that baby. You let Mitch think it was his grandchild. What kind of sick coward risks his own flesh and blood just to get in someone's pants? That's not how it was. That's exactly how it was! Stacy's life is in danger because of you. Your baby's life is in danger because of you. An innocent life, but who gives a damn just so you can get with Gigi? I did care about that baby. I do care about that baby. That's why I'm in the will. That's why I couldn't do what Stacy and Kim asked me to do. What, what are you talking about? Nothing, what do they want you to not, do? Nothing. You know, they're always, they're always, you know, scheming for something. Hey, hey, I'm okay. You want to know what it is? You want to know what they asked me to do? They didn't want to have to fake going into labor, okay? So they asked me to make it real. What? I couldn't do it. I couldn't jeopardize my child by bringing it into the world before it was ready. Baby, I don't know what's going on here. Why you're coming early, but thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Now Rex never has to know you're not his. 